Okay, so you've probably just uh, just seen the album review of, if you're watching the other one before this, you've probably seen the um, album review of um, Lucifer's Friends um, album, uh, third studio album, um, I'm Just a Rock and Roll uh, Singer. So you probably, if you've just seen that one, this is their... Um, going to be talking about Lucifer's Friends' uh, fourth studio album, um, Banquet. Um, so I find this album here is completely different from uh, from their other albums. Even the album before this, I, I, I find it's completely different from that. From their uh, three other ones before that, their debut album was heavy as anything. Hard rock, you know, you name it. Like, uh, and the second one also was like that, um, hard rock. You know, the, the third one that I just finished talking about, like I said, it was kind of like progressive rock or something like that. So, yeah, so I'm going to be talking about Lucifer's Friend's fourth studio album. It's called Banquet. It was released in 1974 and is a progressive rock slash jazz fusion album. So, um... This one here is completely different from the other one. So the other one that I just done was kind of progressive rock that was in. And the ones before that were kind of like hard rock, heavy metal, hard rock. Um, but, yeah, but um, unbelievable. It's, um, anyways, um, this here is probably, this album here is probably about almost 40 minutes or that. Um, there's not many songs on this album. So the songs include Our World is a Rock and Roll Band. The 11 minute and 50 second song, that's a long one. Uh, Spanish Galleon. Um, a 6 minute and 44 second song. Thus spoke Obrian, O-B-E-R-O-N, however you pronounce that, High Flying Lady, Goodbye, and in the 11 minute and 36 second song, Sorrow, and last is Dirty Old Town. So, um, Dirty Old Town, so, because I know in the band that I am, that I'm in, um, we usually play that song, um, Dirty Old Town, but I don't think this one is, you know, um, different one, because I know, I did an album review, if you like the band, if you like the artist, um, Rod Stewart, make sure to check him out, I've done his debut album, that album review, and, um, done all of his album reviews up until 1978, um, that album, so make sure to check out um, Rod Stewart if you like that. But yeah, this album here, not many songs on it at all. Like, there's, you know, um, I think, yeah, there's different, because, um, this one here, I don't know if this was the original one or no, five or six, there's not many songs on this album. Um, but yeah, this album, listen to, the, listen to the other albums before this album, like um, their debut album. Um, well, I'd say all their albums, all their one, two, three albums before this, or three, you know, before this. And then listen to this. This, one's, this one here is completely different because it's not hard rock. It's kind of like progressive rock, jazz, or a like completely different style compared to the other. Um, but all in all, not a great album. Um, so, um, yeah, because I, I know John Lawton done another album with this band, and then that's when he, he left the band, I think. That was the last album I know that he'd done with them. Um, and then, oh, 1970, probably 77, was it, that he joined Uriah Heep? I think it was then. Um, so, yeah, also I'd done, you know, album reviews of Uriah Heep, you name it, pretty almost all, you know. Um, anyway, so I go through the songs again, then I'm going to finish it off. 
this uh, video off and then I'm going to um, do one more album review of this band and then I'm going to finish it off and then maybe go into either one that I didn't finish yet or go into a completely different band. I'm not sure yet. I guess you're going to have to find out. So yeah, so the songs are Our World is a Rock and Roll Band, the 11 minute and 50 second song Spanish Galleon, the 6 minute and 44 second song Thus Spoke Obrien, Obi, Obrien, Hi Flying Lady Goodbye, the 11 minute and 36 second song Sorrow, and last is Dirty Old Town. So give this a thumbs up. Comment down below. Also check out, um, if you like Super Trap, um, check out um, Indebtedly Stamped. That seems to be doing good. Or Breakfast in America. So I've done the first album all the way up until Breakfast in America. So I've done six. So make sure to check that out if you're a fan of that band. So thank you for watching and make sure to subscribe. And um, all you people that subscribe to me so far, thank you very much. And uh, like I said, the next one I'm going to do of this band is um, their, the last one um, is um, Mind Explos Explo Exploding, I think it's called. And then I'm going to probably go either finish off another band, album reveal of another band, or go into a completely different one. I'm not sure yet. So give this a thumbs up, comment down below, and uh, thank you for watching all you people that subscribed so far. Thank you very much, and uh, bye.